An offer isn't just saying, hey, I have something for sale. An offer is, what's going on everyone? My name is Ted Carr and in this video, we're gonna be talking about how to create irresistible offers. If you don't know how to create irresistible offers, what's gonna end up happening is you're gonna go through this whole process of building up hype for your product launch or for your webinar or your funnel, and then you're gonna finally launch it and everyone's gonna go there and check it out and then no one's gonna buy. And you're gonna be like, what happened? There was so much hype around it. Everyone said they wanted this thing and then they go and check it out and they don't buy. Now, is it because you're off, you're asking too much money? Is it because you're not asking enough money? Is it because your copywriting doesn't tell people what they're actually gonna get? Or is it just because your offer sucks? Nine times out of 10, your offer sucks. Like nine times out of 10, a really, really good offer can make up for horrible copy and horrible funneling and horrible, you know, YouTube videos. A great offer can like take care of everything. You just need to know how to make a great offer. So here's what makes offers work. All right. What I'm about to tell you is the same thing I heard that flicked the light bulb for me is the thing that switched the light bulb on for me. They gave me that aha moment. And that is people pay for things when value exceeds price. So I didn't buy this car because I thought it was worth what Tesla was asking. I bought this car because I felt like I was getting more value out of it than what they were asking. So when someone goes to the store and buys something, even this t-shirt, this t-shirt, I got the bulk t-shirts. I got these t-shirts for like 15 bucks or something. And we are able to sell them for like 20 bucks or 25 bucks or something. Cause we put a logo on them, you know, we paid for logo design, whatever. But point is I bought these t-shirts because I felt the value of them exceeded the price. So the price was 15 bucks. I was like, well, the value is more worth more than 15 bucks. So I'll buy it. That's why people, people buy it. So people don't buy your offer because because it you're asking what it's worth. People will buy your offer when the perceived value of it is far outweighs, far exceeds the asking price. The way to set this up is to have products and services that you have for sale, like on your website or different funnels. And let's say you, let's say for example, you offer coaching. You offer 10 pack coaching session for thousand bucks, hundred bucks per session. And you offer this over the course of a month. Okay, so that's something that you have for sale on your website or somewhere on a coaching funnel. Thousand dollars for 10 sessions. Then let's say you also offer meal plans. You offer 30 days of custom meal plans for 500 bucks. And you also offer uh, custom workout plans, 30 day custom workout plan for 500 bucks. So now you have these three things that you offer. Now let's say, or that you have for sale. Now let's say you wanna to put together an offer. And an, an offer isn't just saying, hey, I have something for sale. An offer is a series of products or services that you're bundling together. That's an offer. So an offer isn't a sales pitch. An offer isn't a price tag. An offer isn't a sale sign. An offer isn't saying, buy my thing. An offer is a package. It's a bundle of things that you have for sale that make, that make the customer feel like they're getting a deal, that make the customer have their mouth start watering, that make the customer's pupils dilate, that makes the customer think, wow, I'm getting a great deal because they are. All right. So to put together the offer, rather than saying, oh, um, I'm offering coaching for a thousand bucks. You say, no, no, no. You say, hey, I'm offering a coaching special this month that includes 30 days of coaching with me or 10 sessions customized meal planning and customized workout plans. Now, usually for a month of coaching, it's a thousand bucks. Usually for a 30 day meal plan, it's 500 bucks. And usually for a 30 day workout plan, it's 500 bucks. So total is this right here is valued at $2,000, but you're going to be able to get it today for just 500 bucks. Now that's going to make people think 500 bucks. That's a great deal because coaching alone is normally a thousand bucks. Meal planning alone is normally 500 bucks. Workout plan alone is normally 500 bucks. I'm gonna get all that for just 500 bucks? Like, of course, let's go for it. So your offers need to be no-brainers. So my best webinar offers, they've all been no-brainers. All my best webinars, they've all been no-brainers. And as a result, people buy. Now, it's not just the offer, right? It, there's other things involved, like your funnel, like your story, like your hook, right? Hook, story, offer. You need to have a good hook, you need to have a good story, you need to have a good offer. But if your hook sucks and people happen to say, okay, I'll check it out anyway, even though your hook sucks, and they read your story and you know, your story sucks anyway, and it keeps scrolling down to find out what the offer is, or they wait to the end to find out what the offer is, and your offer is freaking mind-blowingly amazing, they're going to take it. So a great offer makes up for a shitty story and a shitty hook. 
Of course you want great hooks, of course you want great stories, of course you want fantastic offers. But even if your story sucks, your offer sucks, or sorry, even if your story sucks and your hook sucks, if you have a great offer, you'll still be making really good money. So keep this in mind. People pay for things when value exceeds price. People will buy something from you if the value of what you're selling or the perceived value of what you're selling exceeds the price that you're asking. So value must exceed asking price. That's what you need to, to have in your brain when you're creating an offer, creating a compelling offer. And when, you comp when you're putting together offers, also keep this in mind. This is a really, really fantastic tip. Let's say uh, you're offering coaching. And the goal of the coaching is to help somebody improve their, uh, their bodies, to get them to look fit, okay? So you're coaching. And what does the coaching actually accomplish? The coaching, the one-on-one -on -one calls of the coaching, what that really helps people with is it makes sure that all their questions get answered so they have clarity and it keeps them accountable. It offers accountability. Now, what does, what would somebody need in addition to that to reach their goal? This is where the other elements, this is where the other items of the offer come in. So you might think, oh, well, they might need to know what to eat. Great. Offer a meal plan. They might need to know what exactly um, to do in the gym. Great. Workout plan. Right? So now they have a workout plan. They know exactly what to eat. And they're getting accountability coaching from you with um, unlimited Q&A. So this is the full meal deal, the full package. So when someone sees that, they think, oh, there's no way I can fail. It's the ultimate success package. So all your offers need to be ultimate success packages. So... If you're going to teach somebody how to, um, how to train a dog, you know, you might, you might have, um, the ultimate, um, hand commands, right? A list of hand commands, like body language, what to, what to show the dog like down or roll over, right? You might have a, a set of those that you can include in the offer. You might have a list of voice commands like down or roll over or jump or play dead, whatever, your voice commands. You might have um, a uh, list of resources that you can that the person can purchase, like whistles or bells or uh, leashes or, God forbid, shot collars, whatever. You might have a list of, of, of resources that people can um, grab as well, like items. You might have a list of... Um, breeds that are that are easiest to train or whatever you you want to put together everything all together in a package so that the person can't fail there's no way that they can fail if they buy your program they buy your service you're going to include everything for them so they can't fail so when they get into when you because when someone gets into whatever you're selling there's going to have problems are going to arise problems are going to come up so it's your job to address those problems before they come up and say hey like when you get into dog training you might not know what to do with your body language. This guide's gonna show you exactly what to do that. When you, excuse me, when you get into body or uh, dog training, you might not know what to do with your voice commands. This guide's gonna show you how to do that. You might not know what clothing to wear or what tools to use. This guide's gonna show you what clothes to wear and what tools to use. So you, how can you fail, right? How could you possibly fail? Plus you're getting a bonus set of interviews with the world's top 10 most renowned dog trainers. Right, so now they're, oh my God, now I'm getting advice from like 10, successful dog trainers like now i really can't lose because i got all that stuff plus i get 10 interviews with these dog trainers right so this is just an idea as an example of how to put together a really really cool offer for someone make sure they cannot lose and to round it all off once you've made your offer you gotta let people know that you, you offer risk reversal you need to apply the principle of risk reversal because people don't want to lose their money they might think, oh my God, if I buy this and it still doesn't work after all that, then I just wasted 97 bucks. I just wasted $997. I just wasted $47. I just wasted $7, God forbid. No worries. So what you got to do is you say, hey, I also offer 100% money back guarantee. So for if whatever reason you're not happy, within 30 days, you get a full money back guarantee. And I don't care if it's 29 days, 23 hours, and 59 minutes from now. If you're not totally happy, not totally blown away by the results you get with this program, we'll give you a full money back guarantee. Now, I don't know about you, but that to me sounds like a no-brainer offer. So you're telling me I get all this, regularly valued at, you know, $3,000. I get it all for just 97 bucks, and I get a full 30-day money back guarantee? Now, this offer, it's still, no matter how good it is, it's not going to be for everyone. But it will be for your perfect customer, which is why it's so important to identify your perfect customer. Yeah. I'll see you around at tedcarclass.com because that's where we're going to be going deep into this sort of stuff.
and I'll be showing you exactly how you can create a wildly profitable online vegan business for yourself. Tedcarclass.com, completely free, step by step, showing you the way. All right, I'll see you around. Peace out, much love. Adios. Something that really changed the way I put together offers. And this thing that we're going to be talking about. What's going on, everyone? It's Ted Carr here. And in this video, we're going to be talking about offer hacking, how you can hack your offers to make them so much more compelling, so much more irresistible. Now, before I heard about this,